leading in. Ooh, 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 ooh. One, two, three. All right. Hello, and welcome back to Pancake Place to the Moon. All right, now we are getting into Johnny's blocked memories that he suppressed with beta blockers. Apparently, when he was a child, to suppress this memory. So I'm very hesitant to see what's going to go on, but let's go ahead and try. I suppose all we can do now is send the signal and hope. Well, ready? Oh! Something's happening. Quick, send it again. What's going on? Oh. Doctor, something's wrong. What? Take over for me, Lily. His condition has been destabilized. Intake levels must be reconfigured. What's happening to this place? It's been destabilized. Get out. What? Get out of his memory now. What are you talking about? If the system doesn't restabilize soon, the shock might permanently damage whoever's in here. You've gotta be kidding. Why aren't you getting out then? I can't kneel. If both of us get out under the state, all of our work will be reset. There won't be enough time to redo all we've done before Johnny. Are you freaking... Don't pull that contract crap on me. This ain't a movie and you're no hero. You're just being a moron. Then why are you being one too? Get the hell out of here. Screw that. If you're gone, they'll probably pair me up with... <laughs> with Alistair. Do you even know how badly he smells? Worse than the roadkill. Damn it, Neil. This is what I get for helping you cheat through the entrance exams. Doctor? I think we're okay for now. <laughs> Just arguing back and forth. And guess what? Your carrot cake sucks. Wait a minute. Yeah, and that the last Christmas party, you... Oh. Come on, let's go before that happens again. Um, you know I didn't mean to. You know, call you a moron, right? You know that I did, right? <laughs> oh, I love these two. How can I get there? Do I have to go down? Oh. No, I think I have to go down. No. Not down. Oh, soccer ball. Okay. Here goes nothing. Wow, I can't believe that worked. 
so we actually made it. But now I'm not sure if I'm going to like this place. What do you mean? It seems peaceful enough. Neil, did you notice something odd in Johnny's room earlier? Er, what? There was something strange in there. Did you not see it? I... I suppose not. Never mind. I just hope I'm wrong. Wow, that sounds fabulous. I know, right? You've got to take their take them there one day. Sheesh, time overlaps getting out of hand. Look at how many of them there are. It's like a zoo. Mhm. Mm Ha, huh, it looks like the ball's moving around on its own, and he's just chasing it. There's the roadkill. All thanks to this little fellow's sacrifice. I hope. Oh jeez, look at the time. I better get going, the store closes early today. Oh, take care, Martha. Say hello to the boys for me. I will. I'll see you around. The boys? Was Johnny an only child? This is... Well, this is the end of the road. You were saying? Never mind that. Maybe I was wrong after all. I mean, this place, it's so peaceful. The only thing that exists in this memory that could do such a thing would be. Shit. Duh. We need to go back now. Wait, what's going on? Just shut up and come. Oh no. <gasps> no, 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 no. Don't go in the street. Don't go in the street. Oh no, no. Shit. Can we save him? No. No, 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 no. understand. If he was unconscious, how could we be seeing this here when he never did? Still, I'm just surprised that he survived. Actually, he didn't. Er, what? Didn't you see it in his room, Neil? Johnny slept on a bunk bed. Joey! Joey, can you hear me? Joey? Why did you hit Joey, Ma? Why did you hit him? Joey! Joey! Wake up! Joey. 
even though they were young. So there's a twin brother, not to mention how their mother must have felt. At least Johnny had the beta blockers to erase the memories. Not like he remembers it much. Fuzzily unlinked, not erased. Somewhere in there, the aftermath of those memories probably lingered. What about their mother? I don't think she took the beta blockers. She seems to have gone a little cuckoo. At least I really don't think she called Joey... She called Johnny Joey as a nickname. But if she then takes Johnny for Joey, what about Johnny himself? I don't like it here. Let's move on. Where do I go? It seems like this wasn't the only memory unlinked. Odd, it's not putting up a barrier anymore. Don't jinx it. Dude, you should totally give this series a try. I mean, really, it's just wicked awesome. I've already plowed through three books straight. What's it called? Animorphs. It's about this group of kids turning in animals to fight mind-controlling slugs. Meh, I don't like that weird alien stuff. Why not? It's great. Instead of going to boring school, they could turn into tigers and mole big bat into aliens. They're all like, rawr, rawr. Rawr, rawr, rawr. And then they pick up lasers. And it's all pew, 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 Stop that. Hit. Just watch, Johnny. One day, I'm gonna be a famous writer. I'll write the coolest novel on the block, and every kid will get my book for free. And it'll make us rich and buy you both you and Ma really big houses. How would you get rich if you give away books for free? Free for the kids. The parents will still have to pay, of course. Yeah, I'm sure the parents will be thrilled to give you money. What, you're still mad about the other day? Oh, come on. I called first dibs on the train fare. On the f train fair and square. What happened to your prize anyway? I gave it away. To a hobo? Look, it's not just about that day. You know Ma always favored you. Hey, that's not true. Remember last Christmas? And last Easter, and the time we went fishing, and... Okay, okay, you know what? You can have my train if you want. Really? Yep. I mean, hey, by your reasoning, she'll just get me another one, right? Listen, Johnny, what difference does it make who owns what? Everything that's mine is yours, too. I mean, we both get to play with it, right? Yeah. Right. I mean, come on, you're my twin brother, dude. You're, like, part of me. Boy, let's go confuse the neighbors. <laughs> Wait, in the rain? Yes, in the rain, come on. Receive no animorphs. At the fair.
Some kind of carnival, huh? Shall we look around? How about I look around and you just stand here? How about we continue speaking in the form of questions for the next hour? Quit bothering and go already. Oh, you ruined it. Fruits, fresh fruits, apples, oranges, and tomatoes, we got it all. Wait a minute, tomatoes aren't fruits. Er, yeah they are. They're the ovaries of the plant and contain seeds. That's what a fruit is. But come on, tomatoes? We never even re we never ever refer to them as fruits. We who? I happen to enjoy cooking in groups, okay? Some of us take cooking very seriously. But I don't want this stupid toy. I want the train. It's the only train left. Do you want to exchange your prize for a teddy bear instead? No, I just want the train. Now, now, John. Don't make a scene. Joey would won it fair and square, didn't he? But I won too. He just went first. He? It's okay. I'll let you play with it too. See how nice your brother is, Johnny? Okay. You dumplings, don't block the stand now. Come on, let's see what's over there. I'm not a dumpling. You know what? I'm going to call you Dumpling from now on. You're bluffing. Ah, yes. Fortunes of wonder ahead of you. This one might just become a lawyer, and this one a doctor. Oh my! Come on, I'm getting both of you treats. Hey, where's my tip? Welcome and behold, the world's smallest ferris wheel! Can we ride it? Absolutely not! Does it even work? Absolutely not! Looks like someone just glued chairs to a water wheel. Don't know, don't care. Talking to her. Good or bad, I'll be screwed I'd be screwed either way. Hmm. Where else can we go? What? What to what? Whack a mole. You take a mallet and whack moles. Isn't that animal abuse? They're fake moles, but head. That's how people blow off steam before SP FPS was. Oh, first person shooters. Before first person shooters were invented. How primitive. Yeah, it's a pretty. It's pretty ghetto. <laughs> Where'd you read about it? My grandpa was a fan. Wanna play? Just hit everything on the head and you win. Yes, 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 yes. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Use mouse. Oh. Oh, I'm bad at this. I'm sorry. Oh. 
Time's up. Let's see now. Out of 46 total target appearances, you struck 49 times. What? I made 38 successful <laughs> hits. That's an 82% hit rate. It's your new record. <laughs> Alright, I got three links. Let's go. I'm bad at whack-a-mole. Five bars of memory link. Okay. Two more then. Oh, there they are. Mm hmm. I can never understand you, Joey. How do you stand the taste of them? They're just sour and icky. Sour and. Sour and awesome is what you mean. Just try it. Nah, I don't even want to taste regular olives. You should try at least one, Johnny. Who knows? Maybe you'll like it. Yeah. Aww. I'm done though. Can I go play? Okay, but only at the playground an inch too far. Just leave that bag, I'll keep it for you. No, it's mine. Animorphs was Joey's favorite. Pickled olives were Joey's favorite. I just... Horses. Whew, man, this is... All of the good memories he has, all of the things that make him him, or actually Joey, who died. What are they singing? Way to follow mom's orders, huh? So he wandered off the trail and found a cool place. But let's face it, he could have also been eaten by a pack of tigers. Tigers don't travel in packs, idiot. It was just an expression. You know, when I was a kid, my grandpa took me stargazing every year. Yeah? There was a hill outside the city that we'd stay at. The same one every year. We'd watch the stars till daybreak. Well, I did mostly. You just carried the telescope for me. Of course. 
thing was, though, Ma didn't want me to stay up late. Grandpa always told her that we were just camping and hid the telescope inside his car. That's all good, but when we got back to the morning, I had to pretend like I'd actually slept. So in the conclusion, that's the story of how I started my caffeine addiction. You're terrible. I know. It's a shame, though. All these nice memories, lost and never found. And who knows how many more like it. Well, as you say, just take it in the moment. Take it moment for a moment, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, shoot. I told you packs of tigers dwell here. spot. Your spot? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hog this place all to myself. Um, you want to join me? Are you here to watch the stars? Are you? so many lights in the sky? Yes. Oh, I did too. You said this was your spot, right? Only during the carnival. Not a fan of the crowds? Me neither. You know, you still haven't told me your name yet. I'm not telling you. Everyone makes fun of it in school. Why? They say it makes them want to go to the washroom. Uh, okay then. Well, it can't be worse than John. I mean, everywhere in the world, nearly everyone's named John. Even in India? Probably. What's wrong with that? Hmm? What's wrong with having a name that everyone has? Well, it's boring, I guess. I mean, if everyone has it, then what's the point? I wouldn't mind. Just for once, to have the same name that everyone else has. It's like those lights in the sky. They all look the same from here, but that doesn't make them any less pretty. I suppose. What do you think those stars up there are anyways? My dad said they're giant burning spheres of gas. Oh, I bet he's just making it up. Why would he lie to me? Because, you know, that's what grown-ups do. They make things up. Santa, Easter Bunny, kangaroos, stuff like that. <laughs> kangaroos. Oh, jeez. Have you... Ever made an Easter Bunny out of stars? Like a constellation? Yes. Um, of other things. Never tried a rabbit, though. Do you want to make one? Yeah, we'll make the bestest constellation ever. Let's see who makes one first. Let's see who makes one out first.
Okay, we'll start in three. Three, two, one, and I see it. Oh, where? In the sky. Um, but where in the sky? Think big. Eh, bigger than all the others. I don't know. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I see it. Tell me what you see. There, right? There's the two ears and the head. What else? And there, there's its two feet. Yes, what else? And, and the moon. The moon is its big round belly. They really are. The stars, I mean. I... I never told anyone, but... I've always thought they were lighthouses. Billions of lighthouses, stuck at the far end of the sky. Wow, it must be so lively up there. But it isn't. They can see all the other lighthouses up there, and they want to talk to them. But they can't because they're all too far apart to hear what the others are saying. All they can do is shine their lights from afar. Oh, she's talking about herself. So that's what they do. They shine their light. <laughs> they shine their lights at other lighthouses and at me. Why you? Because one day. I'm going to befriend one of them. <laughs> Aww. That bag, what's in it? Oh, it's the prize I won from a whack-a-mole. Did you get to play that game? I tried, but I'm too clumsy. What did you get from it? I got a... thing. I don't really know what it is. some kind of weird duck beaver thing. May I see it? It looks so strange. I wish I could win one myself. Johnny? Eek, that's my calling. Here. You know what? Keep it. It's yours. Mine? Yeah, I can always get another. I don't like to brag, but I'm totally the best at that game. Will you be here next year? Yep, will you? Yes. Same place, same time? Yes. What if you forget, or get lost? Then we can always regroup on the moon, silly. He forgot. Right on the rabbit's tummy. Johnny! Coming! Oh yeah, I forgot my hacky sack in the bag. You said you're clumsy, right? Maybe it'll help. to go to the moon. If they ever got lost. Wait, does that mean... Don't tell me you didn't see that coming. And here I thought this was going to be an inspirational childhood dream story. I should have known that some girl would come along and turn it into a cheese fest. I suppose now we know what we must do to send them to the moon. Wait, you aren't actually going to do it, are you? It's our job, Neil. What we what we're contracted to do. Damn it, Eva, wait. 
Never. I know you're in here. This is all your fault. There she is. Turn around. Neil. I know what you're planning to do. I know that you know. Yeah? Well, I know that you know that I know. Look, our contract is to send him to the moon. And the only way for that to happen is if Johnny is motivated to do so. But if that means removing River, then what's the point? The reason why he even wants to go to the moon in the first place is because she died. I know. But we're legally bound by the contract to specifically... Fuck the contract. I didn't take this job to make him miserable, Eva. I don't know about you, but I signed up to help the freaking geezers... To help freaking geezers die happy. Me too. And I like this job. But if we directly go against our legal obligations, we'll be in our... We'll be... We'd be in for court hearings. We appeal. We know that Johnny'd be happier to not go to the moon. Johnny would be happier with a lot of alternate life tangents, Neil. We are not here to play God. Our job is to give him what he signed for. But we happen to know what he wants better than he does. Look, I'm only risking losing River because I believe in her, and... What do you mean, risk? You're removing her. And besides, I'll make up for it. Make up for it? How? We're running out of time. Just trust me. Says the one who pushed me off the lighthouse. Did you just... Friggin' light data. Abusing your powers doesn't disable my controls entirely, Eva. Booby traps, really, Eva? Just trying to buy some time. Gee, thanks for telling me. Those are some expensive pieces of equipment you're tossing. Seriously, just stay put and wait till I'm done. Oh, piss off. Look, don't make me, don't make me exit this whole thing and unplug you. Would you really risk distorting his memories as they are? Just stop trying, please. This won't take long. Ugh, not again. Or come and find me at the end of the hall. Oh, you've got to be freaking kidding. Is this a game to you, Eva? Dear lord, they aren't just zoo- they aren't just zombie Evas. They're zombevas. <laughs> Don't come any closer. I've got plants. I don't. Oh, W A S T. Oh, 
How do I even get past these guys? Thank you, game, for letting me skip that. Things are good for something after all. game. Be nice. Ugh. There's four of them. How am I supposed to get around? still have plants. I didn't know I still had them. Really? thing is just a loop. Eva, what happened? Eva? Oh man, this is weird. What else? Billions of lighthouses stuck at the far end of the sky. Now the whole construct's messed up. It's finished, River. She won't be alone anymore. I just... I just don't want to be another typical kid in a sea of typical people, Nick.
What is it like? Just the responsibilities, I suppose. Typical kid in a sea of tickled people, yeah. Horses. The Emperor's New Clothes by Hans Christian Andersen. It's their shadows dancing in the lighthouse. There's the last rabbit, I think. <gasps> no. Hello. Wait, don't go. I'm Johnny. What's your name? Your spot? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hog this place all to myself. I'm Johnny. What's your name? Look, it was a long time ago. There's no date or time, Johnny. There's no date or time. Hello, Neil? Morpheus? What? It's Eva, you idiot. No, mm, we're the only ones here. Listen, whatever you've been doing, stop it. We might not know what Johnny wants, but we know what he doesn't want. And what he doesn't want is exactly what you're accelerating. It's already done, Neil. Why don't you come out now? She's merely going elsewhere. You know, it's one thing to disable my controls to feed me some olives. But this is way out of line. I'm sorry, but this just won't go anywhere if you keep on resetting the memory. At this point, this is the only way. I'm asking you to trust me. So please just calm down and wait here. Then just pull the trigger already. Where are you going? There's just one last thing I need to do. Poser, there's no need to visualize the door. What's with all this melodrama, Neil? Why are you fighting so hard for this? Forget it, there's no time. Everything will be alright, man. Just turn around. Okay. Okay. 
Hey, what are you? Shh. Ahem, hello. Sorry, kid. It's already started. Come on, they're gonna hog all the good tables. They're all the same, sheesh. Nah, Joey's right. The ones by the kitchen smell better. Totally, and all of and all. And olive refills are just steps away. Ugh, olives. Saving him doesn't justify it. He can always find another river and heal. But I only have one brother. Come on, we're in the way.
actually made it, huh? You sound surprised. Whatever happened to we always succeed because we're awesome? This isn't a success. Oh, well, lighten up. We're in NASA. We don't have much time left. Let's at least check this place out. Please wait here. Someone will come and show you around shortly. She, she really likes this backpack. To the moon. A s the story about a lame duck's attempt to become an astronaut. A novel by Joey Wiles. I can't believe this crap actually sold. This isn't the real world, Neil. Can't go in there. Is it me or is this elevator smaller on the inside? This is the mission control center. There's not much going on now, but you'll see it live one day. I have expected to see Zordon on that screen. It's not here. What? Let's just go. So, do you think the last century's moon landing was... Let's not, Neil, yeah, let's not. Your records are excellent, but we'll have to monitor your status closely in the coming sessions. Here's the centrifuge, and if you're lucky, you'll learn to hate it one day. <laughs> ah, yes, the spinny thingy. Not here either. What are you talking about? Come on, we don't have long left. What is she looking for? I hope the real NASA has bigger elevators. The shuttle's still under heavy maintenance. We may only view it from here for now. Ugh, this isn't good. Perhaps there's somewhere we missed. Er, you need to work on your communication skills. Whoa. Yeah. You know what's the best part of it? What? The very top and bottom of the shuttle. I'd have to agree. Oh, how I pity anyone who can't see the p those particular parts. Indeed, especially its nose at the top. When the maintenance finishes, it probably won't look the same. Yeah, now's the only time. Did 
Did I miss a part? Must have. First floor. Oh, I couldn't go in here before. I wonder if the real NASA looks like this. Probably not. It's constructed in part with Johnny's beliefs, after all. Ah, yes, a wiki of existing facts tainted by personal fa fairy tales. It's odd, though, to hear birds and see none. Sorry, Neil. I really thought there was a good chance. What? This was the break room. Here's David. He's a mission specialist. Nice to meet you. At least he got into NASA, I guess. You think he made it to the end? Even if he did, it'd take more than that just more than just a few years to become an astronaut. Let's hurry and find the last link then. I'd hate to miss the finale. What's going on? Are we out of time? I... I don't know. Ah, and here's our other new recruit. River, right? Good to have you on board. Hello, I'm John. Phew. I almost thought she wasn't... What the... Eva? But you deleted her. No, I told you. I just moved her. What she does with her life here is still up to her. This new world, it's based on public data and Johnny's own beliefs. And since River data, River's data as an individual is not recorded in the public domain, it all comes from Johnny. But even then, that merely increases the odds. How are you sure it would work? I wasn't... It could have gone very badly, you know. You were never one to take risks, Neil. Let's just say I won this round. We still have the two spare helmets, right? I think Johnny appreciates some company. He wrote it himself, apparently. Rather repetitive, if you ask me, though. What's it called? To 
the moon. I like that name. Oh, there you are. You two should get some rest. Tomorrow's a big day. I want to be an astronaut too, Dad. One day, son. You just might. Meh. Oh. Did you think that they would make it? Huh. Did you? No. The way she is, I didn't think she would succeed. But I, I guess I was wrong. All the better then, isn't it? Yes. I'm happy for them. You should have seen him back when he went to s when we went to school together. I swear the guy never rested. He just kept on trying and trying. It was like the he only had one goal to work for. You know, that's my brother in that cello. Wow. Yep, I once wrote a book about this too. With a less optimistic ending. <laughs> I might have to change that after all. Hey, Dr. Watts, right? Thank you for letting us in here. Yeah, yeah, Eva's the one who requested it. Did you find out why you wanted to go to the moon? Sure. And? What? What all happened here? Let's just say it was a bunch of sappy cheese that sorted itself out. You know, there, there were quite a few times last night where I thought we lost Johnny. I think he consciously held on to wait for you two. He's rather patient then. I just hope it's worth the wait. Go on now, your colleague's waiting. I thought this might be a good view. Good enough to cut off the traffic, eh? Sure, even if they're... even if they were real. Well, this is it. All we've worked for. Ready to initiate it? Come up here. Why? Why not? You're just gonna push me off the ledge again, aren't you? Probably. But the view's worth the odds. Come on. What's happening? 
happening. Because one day I'm going to befriend one of them. He has to make it. their house together. So as the credits play, I'm going to... Wow, I can't really talk. <laughs> oh, that was such a... Ah, I hate my friends when they're like, you're gonna cry. I'm like, yeah, I probably will. And I did. <laughs> I got really sad when the boy got hit. I got really sad when I thought that they were just gonna delete her. The whole ending of this game. I'm so happy you still got to be together with River at the end. I recommend this game, but then again, if you've seen the ending already, you kind of get it. Ah. Oh. I don't even know what to say. <laughs> it's such a beautiful game and I can't... I, I don't know what to say to even close it up because I'm too... sad. <laughs> but I'm not, I'm not sad. This game... Oh. Here he 
is. Thanks. Off you go now. I still can't believe Johnny just willed the house to Lily like that. <laughs> Who else was, was there to give it to? Us? Terrible place for burials, though. If there was a landslide, they'd be swimming with the fishes. Still a little too soon. No, it's never soon enough. Nice new ringtone. Hello? Eva here. We're on our way. New patient? New patient. Let's roll. sweet. I don't even know what to think of it. This was a wonderful game and thank you for joining me. This has been Pancla Pancake Place to the Moon. I will be playing a happier game next time because I need a break from being sad but thank you so much for everyone who recommended this game to me and thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.